Today I'm going to show you how to make miniature takeout coffee cups. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of the white and roll it into a soft cylinder shape. I want the bottom to be slightly smaller than the top to give it that cup look. Make the top and the bottom flat so it can stand up if you don't want to make it into a charm. Take your blue and roughly cut out a circle the size of your cup. This will be your lid. Mm -hmm. Once you've got the size you want, you want to just fit it on your cup. Kind of bend down the edges because this will be your lid. Next you want to take a medium brown. If you don't have that color, that's alright. You can just make it by mixing white and brown together. Just keep working it and just breaking it apart and pretty soon it'll just turn into a brown. It doesn't have to be the exact color. It just has to be a lightish medium brown. until you have the color you want. Next, take your brown and just keep pulling it until it's very thin. This will be the kind of cozy thing on your coffee to make your to keep it warm and also so you don't burn your fingers. Next, you want to take your cup and kind of roll it in the cozy. If it covers up most of the white, don't worry. You can always make it thinner and longer by just rolling it out. If it's if the brown's hiding up too much of the white and you want to see more of the white, just take a bit of scrap white, roll it into a long thin snake, and then just put it on here. And then if you want it to be flat, you can kind of just um, make it flat so you just kind of push it in or roll it to give it the same kind of texture. Next part is you want to take your red and you want to make a little label. So just take a part of your red, make it flat, and then just use an X-Acto knife or small knife and just cut a square the size you want out of it. You can have a rectangle, really any shape. Next, pick a spot for your label and just push it on. If you want it to be like 
same thickness as your cup, just roll it in. But there's your coffee cup. Okay, now stop. I chose to make them kind of patriotic colors, but really you can use any colors you want. You could change it to like a pink top, blue bottom. It really doesn't matter what color you use as long as you use the same idea. You can make this into a simple and easy charm by just adding an eye pin in. You just screw it into the top like this. And then all you have to do is bake it for around 30 minutes. And that's your takeout coffee cup.